Welcome back, True Seeker. Just got a package in the mail from a man named Thomas. Really appreciate it. Want to share with you what he sent to me. That's showing up on the camera there. You should see the Stoneman Douglas Eagles were the baseball champions in 2016. And... Right away, what that makes me think of are the Chicago Cubs who won the World Series in 2016, as I guaranteed they would in spring training. Recall, Anthony Rizzo, who plays for the Chicago Cubs, is also the alumni of Stoneman Douglas. And after the shooting, he spoke out about the shooting and how something needs to be done. And as I showed, Anthony Rizzo's birthday was a span of 191 days before the shooting. The name Anthony Rizzo in Gematria sums to 191, and the reason that matters is for two reasons. One, active shooter equals 191, a number that shows up in these mainstream shootings again and again. Two, 191 is the 43rd prime number, and massacre equals 43. So does killing. This was a Valentine's Day massacre, just like back in 1929 in Chicago, where the Cubs are out of. So think about it. Think about the parallels here. We're talking about how the world of sports is scripted with news. Professional, college, and even sometimes high school. And since the shooting, we've now seen how Stoneman Douglas won the hockey championship, coming into the tournament as the bottom seed upsetting Jesuit. And as we know, the Jesuits have much influence in this nation, from police to media to government to the scripting of sports. So just think about it. Think about these parallels. You know, Cubs win the World Series, Anthony Rizzo on the team, used to be alumni at Stoneman Douglas who won the championship that same year. Let's not forget that Anthony Rizzo wears the number 44 too, and the numbers these athletes wear are not arbitrary, they're not picked by them, they're given to them for a reason. With regards to 44, shooting equals 44, so does Lupercalia. Lupercalia goes from February 13th, starting on the 44th day of the year, to February 15th. This shooting came on the second day of Lupercalia, you know? The word kill, 44. The word execution, 44. Number found around death often. And here we're talking about a story connecting to death. And now Anthony Rizzo, who's related to that story. Like I always say, true seeker, there's always more. And until about 10 minutes ago, when the mail showed up, I had no idea about this part of the riddle, you know. Stoneman Douglas, baseball champions in 2016. And you can bet your bottom dollar... It was rigged that way. Rigged to be is all part of this long, planned, ongoing narrative. And just like we talked about, this school, named after a woman from Minneapolis, the 612 area code, where the Philadelphia Eagles had just won the Super Bowl in Philadelphia. This school's the Stoneman Douglas Eagles with the exact same Eagle logo as the NFL team. And that number 612, Big number in the shooting, coming 612 days after the Pulse nightclub shooting, where the motto was Orlando Strong, which equals 612 in Gematria, just like the word Valentine equals 612, plus everything else we talked about. And again, that woman, Marjorie Stoneman Douglas, she died at age 108, very long time to live, bringing it back to baseball. Major League equals 108. The reason I knew the Cubs would win the World Series from spring training is because they were going to break the 108-year curse of not winning a championship. On every baseball, there's 108 double stitches, the number representing geometry. And consider, geometry also has geometria 45 in addition to 108. The shooting was on the 45th day of the year. With regards to Cubs, Cubs equals 45. So does Wrigley. So does Illinois. The Cubs hadn't been in a World Series since 45 before they won it in 2016, plus everything else we uncovered. So thank you so much again to Thomas. You know, go out and find yourself one of these. He said he found it at the Goodwill. Amazing find. You, know, you never know what you'll find at the Goodwill.
All right, true seeker. Till next time. Encore. Just want to give you a little math. Notice Anthony Rizzo turned 28 years old, August 8, 1989. Good year to be born and connected to the ritual because the Chicago massacre on Valentine's Day was in 1929, 89 years before the massacre at Stoneman Douglas. And with regards to 89, the word chaos equals 89, where the Masonic motto is order out of chaos. Anyhow, from his birthday, August 8th to February 14th, a span of 191 days. And again, his name, Anthony Rizzo, 191 using the alphabetic order. Active shooter, 191 using the reverse alphabetic order. And remember, Society of Jesus, who are the Jesuits, Gematria of 191. Consider, the hockey team just won the championship against Jesuit as underdogs. And as I pointed out the day of the shooting, it came on a date with numerology of 54. Stoneman Douglas equals 54. So does Jesuit order. You see? Date of the shooting, 54 numerology. 2 plus 14 plus 20 plus 18 equals 54. And again, from the Chicago Massacre in 29 to the Stoneman Douglas Massacre, 89 years old. They said the shooter was 19-year-old Nicholas Cruz. Notice chaos is 19. They said he was dropped off by Uber at 2, 19, Uber 19. Notice Nicholas Cruz, 67, which is the 19th prime number. He was also born 19 weeks after Marjorie Stoneman Douglas died. Nicholas Cruz was born on the day leaving 98 days left in the year, in the year 98. And consider the Philadelphia Eagles just won the Super Bowl to conclude the 98th season. If you want to look at the three championships that Philadelphia won before the Super Bowl era, they were all on dates with numerology in 98. 98 is important as well because this shooting happened during Lupercalia which also has Gematria of 98. You learn the code, you see just how numerical these rituals are. Look up the date of Nicholas Cruz, his birthday, it's out there. You'll see it's the day leaving 98 days left in the year. You'll see he was he born 19 weeks after Marjorie Stoneman Douglas died. All of this stuff is too perfect. It just goes to show how contrived and well-planned it all is. You'll also notice that from Rizzo's birthday to the shooting, six months and seven days. And by the way, 67 is a good number to code on a killer. Killer 67, Bloody Valentine. You've heard the phrase before, 67. So we'll leave it there, true seeker. Until next time.